Many Windows users have reported the issue of missing wireless adapter and when that happens you can no longer connect to the internet which can be really annoying when you are trying to work. So let's see how we can fix the issue. Your wireless network adapter may be hidden in device manager. To locate it back press the windows logo key and X and select device manager. Click on view and select show hidden devices. Click network adapters and then action and click scan for hardware changes. Double click on network adapters to expand the list. See if your wireless network adapter appears among the list. If your adapter appears on the list, double click on it to open its properties window. See if the adapter is working properly. In the window search bar type network troubleshooter and then click on find and fix network problems from the results. Click on next, then click on troubleshoot my connection to the internet. The network troubleshooter will automatically detect the network problems on your PC. A missing or corrupted driver may be the root of this issue. So use advanced driver updater in your system. Download and install the tool. You can also use the link given in the description box below. Once installed, click on scan now button. When the list of outdated drivers appear, either select the network adapted driver and update it or choose update or option from the top to get all the drivers updated. We highly recommend you using this tool because it not only updates all the drivers to its latest version, but also saves time and energy. WinSock is a programming interface and supporting program in Windows operating system and defines how Windows network software should access network services. To reset it, press the Windows logo key and R. Here type CMD and press Ctrl plus Shift plus Enter at the same time to run command prompt as administrator. In the command prompt, type NETSH WinSock reset and press enter. Now restart your PC to complete the reset. If your wireless network adapter doesn't appear in device manager after you tried all the fixes, it's time to consult the manufacturer of your PC for further support. Since the worst case of this issue could be the problem of your NIC, network interface controller card. So that is it for today's video. Hope you found it helpful. If yes, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more.